down two points with time winding down, Antelope Valley got the ball in the hands of Tylen Price, who gets fouled shooting a three-pointer with two seconds left on the clock. Uh, first free throw, I mean, I just had too much adrenaline in my body, and um, I had to knock down the last two free throws to keep us in the game. Price forced overtime, and Morgan Bazell and Nia Page came up with big baskets as AV posted a 49-48 victory. It builds our confidence up a lot. Last year, we had a bad taste from them. We lost them in their tournament by 20, so um, we were definitely looking forward to this game, and we came out and we showed who was the better team, and we just played hard. We never gave up. Valencia had one last chance to win it, but Sabrina Thompson's jumper was off target, igniting a celebration for Antelope Valley as it won its 16th consecutive game. They also avenged a 20-point loss to Valencia from last season. We played harder. We had more pride. We we came out hungrier than ever. Like we wanted this really bad. We've been working for this for a while. But how bad? Like well, how bad? Like championship CIF bad. Antelope Valley had plenty of balance as Savannah Sullivan scored 13 points. Price finished with 12 points, and watch this move by Tyler Smith to cap a strong all-around performance for Antelope Valley. This win meant a lot to us just because every day we go hard in practice, and we just, we wanted, last year we fell short in the third round, so we just wanted to make a statement, this year is our year, so it was either go hard or go home. They're a great team, and they came out very intense, and a couple times they broke our press and got the ball to the middle, which is how most of the times they got the ball down the floor, but I feel like we did a good job in transition and stopping the threes and everything. Proud of my team. AV's press and physicality certainly affected Valencia, but Kayla Conrad finished with 25 points, including that three pointer. She also showed a nice mid range touch. Ashley Ane on this give and go from Sabrina Thompson finished with eight points, and Candy Honaker had this put back in overtime, but Valencia couldn't find any consistency. Um, you know, we're just going to go back to practice and work hard, um, fix, the thing, fix the things we didn't. Um, Execute today and come out and win the next games. It's something to learn from, and we'll get stronger and better from this. We have league, league to prove ourselves again, so we're good.